What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today I'm going to be doing a simple tutorial. Remember when the big 4.0 happened? Now I know you guys know what I'm talking about, not the earthquake, the actual system software update for the PlayStation 4. A lot of people have been asking me, one, Monkey Flop, why did my PS4 automatically download the 4.0? I didn't even accept the terms. Um, I'm going to go over that. Also. A lot of people are like, Monkey Flop, I don't even know how to turn on automatic downloads. And whenever I turn on my system, it's really frustrating because I have to wait for it to download as opposed to having it set. How do I set automatic downloads? And then the third one is, okay, I've set automatic downloads, but it's not downloading. What am I doing wrong? So the first thing that we're actually going to cover is, what are you doing wrong? Okay, so let's say you turn on automatic downloads and you are experiencing issues um the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure one you are putting it into rest mode if you're putting it into rest mode then it will automatically and you have your automatic downloads already set then it will automatically download but if for whatever reason it's not go into power save settings go into set features available in rest mode now not a lot of people know about this so um in this you can set whether or not your PlayStation 4 stays connected to the internet now where I live I don't pay for you know you know uh, a, a data cap or anything so of course I'm gonna have mine checked on and when you have it checked on while in rest mode the PS4 can download updates and content uh, upload save data etc so this is very important this is key if your system is not automatically downloading the latest software update if it's not downloading the latest uh you know uh patch updates for your games and different thing, things like that and you know for sure you have it turned on go here and make sure double check that you are connected to the internet even in rest mode okay now let's go ahead and discuss ladies and gentlemen let's go ahead and go into system okay so we're gonna go back all the way back um, we're gonna go into settings just so that you guys don't get confused we're gonna go into system once we're in system we're gonna go into automatic downloads and voila it is right there you're gonna want to make sure that all of the check marks are checked off now um, if you have PlayStation Plus then you know um you'll go through the the whole thing even when you set up your ps4 you'll go through this whole process and if you accept the terms of automatic downloads each and every time there's a new firmware update software update a new patch update for your games different things like that if these boxes are checked you're giving playstation consent to automatically download them to your system so that is why if you do not want your playstation 4 to automatically uh download anything without you knowing ahead of time then uncheck the boxes it's as simple as that if you don't want them to do anything then uncheck the boxes or you can pick and select you know uh featured content do you want them to automatically download featured content uh to the home screen do you want the system software update files automatically downloaded uh even when your playstation 4 is in rest mode um do you want them to install automatically do you want the application update files um and if you're a PlayStation Plus member, uh, the PS4 can download the files in rest mode. That's what I'm talking about. So if you guys have these checked off, then you're giving PlayStation consent to download to your system. You're, you're saying, please let me um, not have to deal with the pain of watching it download. Uh, please, do it, please do it for me. Well, my PlayStation 4 is asleep. Maybe while well, I'm asleep. Um, but if you're the type of person that wants to read patch notes and accept the terms beforehand, like I said, have these boxes unchecked. Ladies and gentlemen, that's it for me. Let me know what you guys think about that in the comment section below. I hope I answered a lot of people's questions because a lot of people have been actually DMing me, asking me, Monkey Flop, <laughs> the, the biggest question is, Monkey Flop, I didn't want the 4.0. Why did it download? And honestly, I don't know why you wouldn't want the 4.0. Uh, 
because I love the folders. I love all the features about it, but um, I could definitely understand like, hey, you know, why is it downloading? So I hope I answered that question. I hope I answered the question for those of you that have been having trouble uh, actually doing the automatic uh, downloads and different things like that. Uh, make sure to hit a like if you guys haven't already subscribed. That would be awesome as well. And I will see you guys in the next news update or maybe even tutorial. <laughs> you guys are freaking awesome.